I found myself really frustrated by the glorification of the war in the project. In my project and in society in general, you know, civil conflict, all these wars, you know, we have Anzac Day, Remembrance Day, all these different days, all these different memorials to remember and celebrate these wars. And it makes me, it frustrates me a little. I don't know if it's insensitive that, you know, I'm, t I'm tired of hearing about all of these wars. What about the the people that endure, you know, the, the domestic conflict within the four walls of their home and hear their stories. I don't... I guess it's a very personal one for me because, you know, my mother endured great domestic um, conflict in her past, you know, war in the four walls of her home. And I'm nearly 20 years old and she, she shuts down whenever I try to talk about these things and... But as I know, I created the mess and you said I'm not going to help you clean it up, but you are, thank you. We were like free spirits, all four of us, the kids. And then there was always the, the time when Dad got home. Like storm clouds arriving. It's like, you know, watching someone get murdered, just diminished, just crushed. He's my dad, at the same time he's my enemy. Some Baba Dees and Sam Thomas, you're not a father, you're, you're a pig. My mum encouraged to get an intervention order against my dad. Things were wrong truly. She started seeing other people. save myself but I couldn't I, I couldn't rest because the other three with it I was gonna protect them Look, I'm trying to save myself but I'm thinking of them they're not safe either and then it just all went to shit you know mum's too busy having a freaking love affair with this pedophile and she just couldn't see she didn't want to see I tried to tell her mum he tried to do this what did she do she did it turn like a princess and just you know it's like whatever she didn't want to hear that much she lost me she's even lucky she's got me now i'm only there because of allah because of my duty as a daughter and she destroyed all of her children because of it why do you think we are the way we are now because it destroyed us all of us and i've tried to make a success of my life despite all of that because i've always been determined okay because i've had to fight back i've had to try to survive i had to keep my head above water i did not feel safe our home was not safe if i just need this an experiment to 
was actually a controversial experiment by some scientists, I think, in America. Dad and I did He did an experiment on these um, monkeys, and he created like a, a mother, yeah? So there was My this pretend mother man. Got a chance and when that to monkey, breathe. baby monkey goes to the mother, the uh, start mother um, from the past. hurts the baby. But the baby keeps going back because it's the mother. It knows that it's the mother. And the, baby, and the mother keeps, I don't know, sort of, um, it jumps at it. It's like had wires or something, so it causes some hurt to the child. But it keeps going. It's back like I'm growing, it but I always felt like I'm growing in a terrarium. It was so sick, I'm and growing these in a terrarium, and I've grown distorted. Watching, these parts of me um, that are distorted, baby, my parts of me that haven't flourished and freely and, and, and comfortably. Sickly, and I'm sure, you know, there's always slow, been slow, this, like, I've just been in my school, I've been shown me being petrified and petrified. But I couldn't seem to, I couldn't seem to, I couldn't seem to, I just couldn't seem to. I But I know I created the mess and you said I'm not going to help you clean it up, but you are. Thank you.